Hi guys, and welcome back to a brand new video. Oh my gosh, so yes, it is that time of the year again where I have a big overhaul of my contact lenses, my colored lenses that I do wear in every single one of my videos. And I thought today we would do another con color contact lens haul video. I will show you them, show them, put them on, I'll show you outside, show you everything, show you great. I just love doing these videos. I know whenever I get new contact lenses, you guys tend to always ask me where I get them from or what, what you know, what's going on. Um, so these are all from a site called Unique So. I've used them for a long time now. Now, full disclosure, I'm not getting paid for this video. This isn't a sponsored video. I'm not getting paid for it. So um, don't come for me saying I'm not <laughs> declaring my sponsor. Although I do have a discount code. So if you do um, want to get anything from their website, if you use the code ROLY in your checkout coupon thing, um, you'll get 10% off your order. Oh my gosh, there's so many lenses. I can't, I can't make them so beautiful. So I'm going to try each pair of lenses on like I did before. A long time ago, I'm going to do this. Try each pair of lenses, show you close up, show everything, um, and have a little talk. Uh, but I'm, oh, oh, should we just get straight into it? Oh my God, let's get straight into it, girls. Now I hope you are ready to gag. Oh my God. Like, can I, I am... Literally, I can't, I got, these lenses are absolutely incredible. They are so bright. They are so cool, like the white and the blue mixed together. I can't even tell you how excited and crazy these ones make me. Like literally, they are so gorgeous. I have never had a blue lens that looks quite like this before. Sweet Crazy Lens Game of Thrones White Walker. I've never seen Game of Thrones, so. Uh, is this what they look like? I just saw them and was just like, oh my God, I need them in my life. The only thing that's very different to these is what, uh, the first time I've ever had lenses that are like this, the iris bit, the tiny bit in the middle where you can, where you see out of, um, is very small. They've made it very, very small. I can still see fine. I can still grab out my day and do normal things, but you can see a lot of the color kind of almost like blocking out. It's a very bizarre way to see. I don't think you should go driving in these. Like if you were to drive somewhere, I don't think you would wear these, but I am just so in love with these. They are absolutely stunning. I can't, I can't even, I just, I, Oh, um, these are like, oh, so let's move on girls. Oh my God. Like, oh, I don't want to take them out on and leave them in forever because they're so gorgeous. Look at the difference to my normal eye. <laughs> <gasps> Fabulous. So these are called uh, crazy Looney Tunes lenses. Now, if you know, if like, if anyone knows like old Looney Tunes ep like episodes, as, as like the the do, 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 do thing used to come in, there was like this like circle with like a yellowy orangey color. Um, now I know I've had like yellow contacts before, um, but I thought these were really cool because it has like the black circle in the middle. I think they have like a nice, really cool, like cool effect on it. And of course, like when it comes to yellow contact lenses, sometimes it can be very hard to kind of get ones that really look quite bright, but I think these ones look so, so good. I absolutely love them. Like most of the lenses I've ever had from Unique, though, so they uh, are super comfortable. They're super, like I, I could wear these all day and know that they don't feel horrible. Um, I, I barely even notice that they're in. So I can see a tiny, 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 tiniest bit of the color because the little hole in the middle was ever so slightly smaller than normal, but um, it's not an issue for me. Uh, so I love them so much, but this is what they do look like in natural daylight. Still, I think they look really cool. So I'm super happy with these. Now, this is a little bit weird for people to see, but taking them out, it's so easy. Like I'm so used to doing it now. Like I don't even need to look to do anything. Like just take the eye down, pull the contact lens a little bit, pinch and out. Easy. As always though, I would advise if you are going to get some color contact lenses, I would tend to get checked out by your opticians first to make sure that you can use them. Cause I know some people can't do it. I'm not really, I don't really know that much about eye science, but I know some people can't have them. Um, so tend, like, do tend to get checked out first please before you do buy contact lenses. But onto the next pair girls. So when I take them out, like make sure that they're facing the white way round cause they can't be inside out. A lot of time with color contact lenses, you can kind of tell just by looking at them because the print is very different on the front and the back. Um, but if it's, in the, if it's on the wrong way round, it'll look like this. This is what it shouldn't look like if you hold it up like this little picture there you can see so next on the list are these gorgeous sweet anime pink lenses these are really unique i've never had anything that kind of has this sort of design on them with like a cutesy sorry this is the thing when you have lenses that have some kind of design on you will notice that they will twist anyone who buys like cat eye lenses anything that has like a specific shape in them they will twist in your eye no matter what you do it's nothing wrong with them it's just how they do it and unfortunately they will twist i can see i've got like a strand of hair in my eye here and I can see it like flutting around. <laughs> so that is one thing that is unfortunate that they do twist, but I do think these look really cool. Have like sort of like a anime-ish kind of like, I think it's like a, meant to be like a glisten. Like, do you know when like the, you see like the cutesy sort of like, 
like almost like that. Do you know that cat from Shrek when it looks up and it has a sort of like teardrop, like sort of like glitten, like glint, what's it called? Like a, like a glimmer in the eye. But I do think they're really cool. They're definitely like a, a unique thing. Just to know that like when they do twist, sometimes it can make you almost look a little bit cross-eyed because some of the design can look a bit funny. For these ones, I would say they're probably very, very good for photos. Like if you quickly position them, take a photo. So for these next ones, oh my God, I cannot tell you how I am, I love these so much. These are quite possibly the best white lenses I think I've ever owned, ever. These have got a funny name, it's called Kazu Mini Scalera Zombified. Um, I am just absolutely in love with these. They have a really, really nice sort of like silvery, white, grayish tone that goes throughout them. They made them almost look like natural eyes. Now, I know people don't naturally have white eyes, but the, the, just, like, the way that the color is like on the lens, it's made to look like a normal eye would be, but it's just white and gray and silver. Normally when I do get white lenses, I tend to get ones that are just like a block color, like a block white. Of course, I'm not wearing any eye makeup or anything as well, so like watch out the fact that my eyes look a little blotchy. I'm very sorry, girls, you're seeing raw face roly today. I'm drinking Starbucks as I'm doing this video and I... <laughs> mm. The one near our house just reopened and we're like, living girl. This is what they do look like in the outside lighting as well. Um, again, these are super cute. I think they're probably my favorite new white lens that I do own. As always, they're super comfortable. I can, like the eye, the, the hole is like the normal size that a contact lens hole would be. Um, so I can't, like it doesn't just like disrupt my vision at all, at all, at all. <laughs> it's really hard doing these outside shots because it's so bright. I'm trying to hold the camera like looking up at the Guys, so you can get the light on my face and the sun, like the, the sun, like going, I can't see anything. Oh my God, it's hard. The, all of these contact lenses that I am using are yearly contact lenses. They always last for one year. I only would tend to go for the yearly ones just because I feel like, because I don't wear them very often. Like I wear them for videos and stuff, but obviously, especially during the lockdown, I haven't really done, been wearing my stuff. That if I only get ones that last like a few months, I feel like I don't really get my money's worth because you know, I don't wear the same lenses constantly and because I have so many pairs, it's like, I feel like I'm just wasting my money if I'm, you know, buying lenses and then wearing them a few times and I have to throw them away because they're like kind of update. And it's better value for money because it's only a little bit more expensive to get the year ones. So for these pairs, woo, these, <laughs> woo, I'm doing Derek Barry's entry, woo. Um, these are, <laughs> uh, these are called Blazing Flame, Blazing Flame lenses, oh my God. <laughs> So these are some yellow ones with a red ring around the outside. Now I'm gonna be honest, uh, the yellow in the middle isn't as bright as I would like it compared to the other yellow lenses I do have. Um, it almost has a slightly more greenish like undertone to it, I wanna say. Um, but I do like them still. I do think they look really cool. I've never, again, I've never had lenses that are kind of like this before, so I am still happy with them. I think a lot of the times when you do buy lenses, it's very rare that they do look exactly as the picture looks in your eye because everyone's eye color is different and stuff and like different eye colors do react differently to the, the color itself. And this is like a really, really thick lens. Like the yellow ones, the pe like the, the color on it is so thick. Like it, it, you can't see natural eye colors behind it at all. But these ones, this yellow, has been painted on quite thinly. So your eye color behind it does kind of mix with it. I do like them still though. I am still happy with them. Uh, I do think they look like a nice little cool effect. And I don't, again, I don't, I've not had lenses like this before. So they are very new to my collection. Um, and this is what they do look like outside in natural day lights. Yes, girls. Now I hope you're ready to be shook to the core, girls. Shook us to the core. <gasps> look at these. I can't even. So these are called Sweet Eureka 7 Cosplay Sakura. Again, I'm not sure what character that is, if it's from a character. I just saw these and was just like, I need them in my life so badly that if I don't get them, I'm gonna jump off a bridge. So of course, purple is like my favorite color and I haven't had purple lenses properly in such a long time that I'm so glad that I have some new purple lenses that look intense. Like I said a little bit about the blue ones, the iris bit in the middle is ever so slightly smaller than normal. Not as, it's not as bad as the blue ones because the part in the center that would recover it is like a, almost like a meshy. So it doesn't actually obstruct your vision like the blue one because the blue one was like a solid color. This whole haul video, like all the contacts in this video, I'm just like obsessed. Like they're my new favorites on everything. Like they're just absolutely gorgeous. I just think that they're the most gorgeous thing I've ever seen in my life. Like I'm just absolutely so obsessed. Like just absolutely obsessed. Obsessed, obsessed. So this next pair, oh my gosh. So I actually don't know the names of this one only because I think because I bought, like I bought obviously quite a few pairs. Um, I think they threw these ones in as like a little extra one. So I don't actually know what the name of these ones are, but I do think they're really cool. They're a little bit like the blazing fire ones, um, but the yellow is just a lot bigger. And the outside of it, like the, the red part is more, it actually looks more, a little bit more like fire than the other ones are. Um, and I do think they're really cool. I think uh, the yellow still isn't as bright as I would probably like it, but I do really like them 
one as well. I think because the yellow on this one is a little bit bigger, you see, obviously you can tell a little bit more. If people don't know, I tend to like color coordinate my video topic to the color lenses that I'm wearing. So like my piercing reactions are kind of like yellow and then my hate comments are like ready colors and then my like piercing horror stories like bluey colors. I, I tend to like mix them. People may notice, I don't know, girls. So this will do nicely within my little set. <laughs> So like I said at the start of this video, I do have a discount code. So if you use the code Roly, I'm going to link every single one of these contact lenses that I've like got in this video. I'm going to link all of them down below um, with uh, and make sure that you do use code Roly at the checkout and you can get 10% off your order. Um, I, 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 you know, I've used Unique So for quite a while now and uh, they've been probably one of the best like lens brands that I think I've used. All the links to everything is down below. Use code Roly, get some 10% off. And one thing I do want to say before I disappear is thank you so much for all my Patreons whose names you can see appearing here. So thank you so much for being my uh, fabulous patrons. But an extra extra special thank you to my top tier patrons, Kenny Bowser, Ziggy Wiggy, Judy Seymour, Alex Prescott, I keep saying names wrong, uh, Philippa Clark and Claire Herman. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for being my top tier patrons and thank you to everyone else as well. Um, Patreon link down below. Have lots of fun things. Go for it, girls. But of course, as always, please hit the like button. Just really, really help me out. Share with your friends with all that kind of stuff. Come follow me on social medias, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, all the Snapchat? What is it? TikTok? Links down below. Come follow me, have a chatty watty. Um, and subscribe, hit the notification bell so you don't miss any videos that I do come out in the future. And as always, guys, be fabulous, amazing, be gay, be everything you want to be. And don't need a bitch that they tell you that you can't be you. Why is that? Because you're flawless. That was a horrendous outro.